What's up, my people? You're under the influence of the voice of Victor Isibo, the face and the voice behind Victor Isibo Reviews. First timers, you're welcome to the channel. This channel seeks to edify you in all ramifications on a daily basis. If personal development is something that tickles your fancy, I invite you to subscribe to this YouTube channel, turn on the bell notification icon so that you don't miss my subsequent uploads. And to my returning subscribers and viewers, salute, it's a pleasure having you back on this YouTube channel. Today we'll be reviewing Colombo Stick. One of my viewers asked that I review this website and here it is, I'm reviewing it. Um, your wish is my command. In typical fashion, before I begin this review, I want to put out a disclaimer. I'm not an investment advisor. I'm just a guy who likes to review opportunities uh, to make money online because a lot of people seek my advice in real life. I tell them what I feel and um, they respect my opinion. So I'm like, why not do this on my YouTube channel? You know, so I'm not an investment advisor. I am prone to make mistakes, so don't use my analysis as a basis for your investments because I will not be responsible for any losses you incur or any profits you make. Okay, do your own due diligence at all times. Do your own research. Now that I've gotten that um, disclaimer out of the way, this is the website of Columbo Stick. Okay, from what we can see right here, these guys are into um, Forex and uh, digital currency investment okay um, this website is um, telling us that Colombo stick is a secure and stable quantitative trading platform as I'm reviewing this website I am angry because I took a closer look at the website earlier before I got on the camera to video this uh, website for you to see I'm disgusted and it's an insult to the intelligence of the potential investor but i don't want to let the cat out of the bag watch the video till the end where i'm going to give you my conclusion on this website but in the meantime let us review the website together they say get started why choose colombo stick they said you earn up to 200 percent per annum they say they cooperate with liquidity providers they have high frequency trading system and artificial intelligence trading algorithm they said they have the shortest return period which is only one day uh, they say it is they say easily invest no matter where you are we use cryptocurrency for settlement so you can invest and get your return on investment easily no matter where you are okay they say they have Say they are changing investment landscape. The forest market is the biggest market, stuff like that. All that we know about forex, they're talking about it. They say they are providing the best investment. They talk about get started. Okay, frequently asked questions: how to invest. They accept Tether, USDT, all around the world, both ERC and TRC tokens, 20 tokens. Um, they also accept bank transfer. And some other payment methods in some regions after your account is being verified is this how to spell verified verified okay verified let me highlight it so that you will see and you will know what I'm talking about verified I thought this was verified I thought this was the correct spelling of verified okay so these guys can't even spell verified well let's pardon them uh, I am pardoning them because I know that one of the things I look out for in a website is all these grammatical errors you know they let the cat out of the bag they make my work easier okay after your account being what does this even mean what kind of English is this after your account being after your account has been verified is what they intend to say but let's pardon their english i don't know where these guys are from but i'll just let it slide so that we can continue with our review okay they say what kind of currency is in my account 
uh, they said of course this is Tether USDT uh, okay how to withdraw uh, you should have a digital currency wallet like the IM token or you can use your cryptocurrency exchange account to receive USDT how to earn bonus you earn 5% uh, bonus from of the person you invited the website is done okay there's a certificate here that was flashed and I want you to look at it carefully Columbus Investment Capital Limited uh, is what they call themselves and uh, they said the certificate number uh, they said they were registered by company house okay as part of my due diligence I decided to come to the website of um, the UK company house and I searched for Columbus Investment Capital and of course uh, the information here is consistent with the one on their website uh, saying that they are registered with the UK company house. Let me address uh, this very quickly so that um, you know we can be clarifying the issues gradually. I don't want to leave anything out. The fact that a company is registered with the UK company house does not make it legitimate. Nope. It doesn't. I tell you authoritatively from my experience of interacting with websites and Ponzi schemes, the fact that you're registered with the UK company house, it is not a sign of legitimacy. Now, if you know NetiSoc Den, they said they were into real estate investments in the UK. Their properties were non-existent, but they were registered with the UK company house and they were traceable. You could find them. NetiSoc Den. If you remember wind thrills, wind thrills, wind thrills, all their properties were fictitious and non-existent, but they were registered with the UK company house. As a matter of fact, aggrieved investors emailed the, the, the UK company house and they were made to understand that it is not in the jurisdiction of the UK company house to vet and check if you're legitimate or not. There are terms and conditions for registering. They are not going to investigate you whether you're legitimate or not. Okay? You pay the required amount of money and you get registered. Okay? Uh, the UK company house is not the Securities and Exchange Commission that, you know, checks whether your audits and all your papers are con or your figures are consistent. They don't do that. It's like the Corporate Affairs Commissions in Nigeria. They don't investigate the legitimacy of what you're doing just tell us what you are doing and just get registered in five days uh, your name your business name is going to is going to show up on their website okay so do not think that this means that they are legitimate because many scams you know have registered on UK company house those guys are not even in the United Kingdom from wherever they are, they do their applications and their names show up in the UK company house. It doesn't mean they are there. So long as you can get a virtual address in the UK, which is very easy for you to get, you will get a UK company house uh, uh, registration. So we're back on the website. And as you can already see, information on this website is rather sketchy. What is the minimum amount of money to be invested? No information. Uh, what is the re expected return on investment? They only said 200% per annum. Nothing specific. Now, I see a WhatsApp icon here. Okay? And I, want, I wanted to interact with it, which I already did before recording this video. And you will see the conversation because I had questions to ask. So when I tapped on it, boom, this is what showed up. I had interactions with whoever it is behind this WhatsApp. Okay, this is not a boat because it's not acting based on commands. So I said, Hi, I have a few inquiries to make. You know, the person did not respond in nine minutes. So I said, Hello, you're online and reading my messages. Please respond, it's urgent. And after two minutes again, he said, hello, what's your problem? Please say. I said, I have no problems. 
please who is the ceo or founder of columbus tick i want to follow him on linkedin send a link to his linkedin if possible thanks he said distinguished columbus vip users important to inform you of the latest notice of columbus headquarters columbus app will be upgraded the guy gave me a relevant answer to the question that i asked so it is i am i feel that i am justified to assume that the answer to the questions i asked does not exist no ceo no linkedin nothing that's why this guy is giving me irrelevant answers to the questions that i asked it went forward to start sharing pictures pictures of some columbus marketers you know uh doing charity work these guys don't look like people from the uk but they have their company registered in the uk regardless you know i mentioned earlier that uk company house you can even be in any corner of africa and you 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 get a virtual address a virtual address a virtual uk address and when you get that virtual uk address you can apply for the uk company house registration uh so they said british columbus headquarters to the Indonesian representative due to impact of the I say who is the owner of Columbus stick this guy says the British government can you imagine he said the British government owns Columbus stick I mean this is terrible preposterous now I said the British government owns Columbus stick what's your office headquarters address then he goes forward to send me this document Okay, uh, saying their address is 71 to 75 Shelton Street, London, Greater London, United Kingdom, WC2H9JQ. Okay, now when you see a virtual address, you will know a virtual address is an address where <laughs> the company does not have to be there physically. Uh, those that have collected money as rent from you to use their office as a virtual address they take they gather information for you when they go ask after you or you get an email they notify you okay somebody made an inquiry do you have any answers you know it's just a virtual address these guys are not there physically it's not a physical address okay you can't go to this place and you will find them and um you know what are your investment packages it is not on the website this guy goes to start telling us uh history of columbus yadi 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 is not answering the question it's just forwarding messages irrelevant messages to me what is the minimum what minimum investment is how much profit percentage is how much what is the tenor he just said 30 dollars okay so it's either this guy uh, is incompetent or is deliberately being economical with the truth now here is what i want us to do now okay um i want us to do a google check of their address of the address that uh, they claim to be at uh, so that you, you can you know you can confirm some of the things that i have said earlier okay um see the first thing that popped up uh firstformations.co.uk registered office address say if you are from overseas you will need a uk address for your registered office okay you see what they're saying if you are from overseas you would need a registered uk address okay now they say your company name seven to 1 to 75 Shelton Street, Convent Garden, London City. Okay, uh, let's keep scrolling. Let's open uh, the first formations.co.uk uh, website. See, they said registered office address service 39 pounds per year. Buy now that same address that colombo stick is using i can create my own company victor Sibo reviews production company i will use that same address 71 75 shelton yadi 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 i pay 39 pounds for a whole year i am eligible to use that address 
then I will use that registered address to apply for my UK company house registration. Okay. So, um, you see, you see now, read this. They say your registered office address. First thing, your company name. So my company name will be on top. Then I will use this same address that Colombo Stick is using. It's as simple as that. If I pay £39, for a year, I will get it. Mm -hmm. See what they read here, what they wrote here. They said, "What is a registered office? A registered office is the statutory address of a limited company or LLP. You must provide registered office details for company's house when you incorporate a company." Read this again. Read this carefully again. That is how they were able to get their UK company house registration. Because they paid a small sum to get a virtual address. That was how they were able to approach company house for registration. That is the prerequisite. Okay, So you can be in Africa, you can be in the Gambia, you can be in Colombia. Have an idea of a company name. Okay, Buy a, 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 an office address in the UK. When you buy it and you are registered, you pay for a year send your documents to the company house they will register you they will incorporate you as a company it doesn't mean you're legitimate okay now i'm going to give my conclusion on this very very website on colombo stick let's go back to their website while i give my verdict on them guys this is my verdict on colombo stick okay First of all, I want to say that this is very glaring, this is very obvious, this company is a scam. Yes, a scam, a very obvious scam, a scam that is not bothering itself too much to convince you. Only people who are who have very low intelligence quotient will fall for this scam. A company who is saying that they have artificial intelligence robot trading forex and cryptocurrency at the same time. Who are your programmers? What is your minimum investment? You couldn't say on your website. It is the guy, that random guy, who chats like somebody who is high on something that is telling me, oh, this is the amount. There's no tenor. There is nothing. There is nothing on this website, that website that would deceive you to even believe that they are legitimate. Okay? Um, I'm giving this company a 0 over 10 on the scale of zero to ten i give them zero and giving them zero i feel i'm even generous i shouldn't even score them at all you know i they, they don't deserve to be scored this is this is 100 percent full-blown scam and you should keep up from this because they have no ceo they have no management team their address is a virtual address they don't exist the guy on the whatsapp is going to block you as soon as uh, everything goes down the drain and they will disappear disappearance for them is very very convenient guys this is a scam do not bother yourself to interact with this website i do not recommend them give this video a like so that the youtube algorithm will recommend it to more and more people share this video and use it to warn other persons say i said it's a scam that's my opinion though uh, you're free to do whatever you want to do with them on your own. Subscribe to this YouTube channel if you haven't done so before. Till I see you in the next video, I remain Victor Sibo. It is bye for now. So